hey guys welcome to the channel i got a small bgs return for y'all today um i believe some of these are stuff that i sent before i started making youtube videos and then another part is some of the youtube videos i made um but let's just go ahead and begin so we have a lugia silver deck silver label so it's either 8.5 or a 9 hoping for the 9 okay we got a slow king and it's also the king which is actually pretty cool so we got a nine nine five ten ten so surface is what made this one be a nine otherwise it would have been a nine five but it is what it is so nine we got a gold label platinum deck and it is a lucario so ten 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 nine five okay that's pretty cool it's actually really dope. I don't think I've ever seen one of these like sold or anything. That's pretty cool to have. Ooh, paper label. This is not good. Yeah. And we have a dark dragon knight. Kind of like swirl right there by the wing. Man, okay, well, that sucks. I was hoping for at least a five. But I love this artwork. So this is staying in my personal collection for now. For now. <laughs> so maybe I get something down the line. Okay, we got the Pichu from Neo Genesis. Remember I picked this up for like 20 bucks a while back. Pretty cheap. I'm glad it. Yeah, at least got the A5, so I got the, the silver label. I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. Probably my favorite Pichu artwork. Okay, we got the Arcanine, Blaine's Arcanine from, I believe this is Gym Challenge, but it's Challenge, Gym Leader 2 Challenge from Darkness. So it's a Japanese set. You got the big old swirl in the back. So we got a nine. That's great. It's also for the personal collection. So I believe most of these were for the personal. Hey, okay. A T-Tar. Sleeping T-Tar. Nine five. There we go. Battle Styles. I remember I pulled this card when I was opening Battle Styles trying to get the Urshifu. But I got the T-Tar instead. This is pretty dope. Um... If you want to hit me up on Instagram or Macari or are interested in the card, message me at Chavez Collects as well. We got the Lugia 8.5. Beautiful swirl. Yeah. Pretty sure the reason is surface. Yeah, and I got the 8 on surface. If I remember correctly, there's like scratches Yeah, in the back on the card there's like a couple dings so as expected but still a beautiful art and then last but not least we have a pa another paper label and it is a typhlosion 17 well technically typhlosion 157 17 in english and I sent this card before I actually got my PSA 10 version of it. So I kind of low-key regret <laughs> sending this one in. But still a beautiful card. And the reason it got decked was surface and edges. Which, I mean, unless I missed something completely. I think this one had a couple. Yeah, it has a print line right there. Let me actually zoom in and see if you can see it. Right there. Yeah, print line. Edges, I don't know, and actually I'm I'm curious, so let's go ahead and see with the black light. Okay, yeah. Lots of wear on the edge. You can see it right there. All across right here. So fair enough, fair enough. So we are finished with this BGS return. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one. And y'all have a wonderful day. Don't.
if you want to see the video where I sent most of these in, which I think it was all, all of these at once, um, I'll link it to that video right here. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, tell me which one of these vintage cards is your favorite one, and we'll be seeing you on the next one. Y'all have a blessed day.